Hey guys, in this video I am unboxing the 8-bit Doe Pro 2 uh, Bluetooth gamepad. Uh, what sparked me to get this is I was playing Super Metroid on the Switch and I didn't really like how this button configuration was with the D-pad so I looked into it and I found an 8-bit Doe which is like a pretty popular choice for Switch users. And yeah, I'm just uh, unboxing this because I don't know what's in the box and maybe some of you are curious as well as I am to see what's in here and what you all get. So, here's a controller. I got the one with the uh, kind of like PlayStation themed kind of buttons here. Which I think is cool. Some people like the more classic Game Boy look that you can get in other options with this controller. And it's got some paddles in the back. And if you can see here, there's a switch for it's, it has an S, A, D, and X. I believe it stands for switch, the A, and the D. I'm not sure. And I think the X might be Xbox. I'm not sure. This is a third party controller, but this feels a lot better. Uh, I haven't tried it yet, obviously, because I'm just opening it now. But this already feels a lot better for uh, maybe like, you know, like those 2D platformers or whatever. Uh, already feels better than this configuration and I'm really excited for Metroid the um, the dread Me uh, Metroid dread coming out in October so I wanted something a lot more comfortable and this seems to be it and I think that is about it for the video I mean it just comes with a uh, the controller and the a USB Type-C um, charger for the controller here, which is nice. Uh, but yeah, here's a look at both of them together. But this really does feel really nice, like this. But that's it. I just wanted to make a quick unbox video, I guess, to see what was in here. Uh, nothing too crazy going on for any of you else that are curious about purchasing one for yourself that's what's in the box thank you guys for watching i will talk to you all later